Hello there, welcome back to Wolf Dances. Right now we have looking at various interesting morning cross portions of Australia. Cross portions of Western Australia. Just in north and east of Perth. Heavy rainfall is possible with this. And um that's all really all there is to note. <coughs> Currently looking at the headlines with the winter storm watches have been issued across portions in Nebraska and the South Care South Dakota, so we'll head into Wyoming, Colorado, and Utah. And heavy rain, heavy snowfall, I mean, is expected. And, um, we have day three. We have around cross portions of Wyoming, South Dakota, as well as Nebraska, and Colorado. There's a 70 to 100% chance of snow over four inches. And they're looking at over eight inches across portions of Colorado. The mountain range in the Rocky High Mountains, up to over 70% chance of over 8 inches, and then 40 to 70% across portions in Nebraska, and also Colorado, and also Wyoming. And then over a foot, um, isolated areas, probably to 10 to 40%, and that's really it. Anyways, moving on. Um, rainfall across portions. Of the west is expected to be a couple inches the entire along the almost the entire coast stretching from California all the way up to the all the way up to um Washington and then as well across portions of um the southeast and into the mid Atlantic and up the northeast coast a couple inches of rain is possible of uh, melted precipitation I should say so um yeah, looking at Storm Prediction Center's outlooks right now, we have general thunder across tonight, tomorrow, and also on day three. On day four and five, though, predictability too low. We'll see what day four will get tonight. Uh, it's not really as um, it seems that something, again, something could still um, happen on Friday, but right now, apparently. Predictability is a bit too low right now. So, anyways, um, we're gonna JCWC's outlook right now. We have um, Terra, Terra Tay. Um, I probably mispronounced that name badly. Although it's expected to break the move to the south, maintain intensity. Over the next period of time until on two days from now, around 18Z, expected a week into 30 knots, and after that, it's expected to dissipate. So really, apart from that, that's really it, and goodbye.